Thank you for having me here as well. Mm -hmm. We are so excited to work with you today. I am a I'm an energy energy medicine healer, and I use quantum. You know, it's a quantum modality that Tahir and I kind of joined together to conduct um, using her light language um, energy medicine and mediumship. And I kind of come in with the energy medicine using telekinetic technology. So you're in for a real treat and we're very yeah. excited. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. So, um, so pretty much how this session is going to go. Um, is we okay. just do kind of a consultation first. We just talk to you, see what's going on with you. And then we'll start channeling messages as you're talking. And then from there, um, as the messages are okay. coming, um, I'll be called to go into light language and then pull down some codes. And then Tiahe will go ahead and uncode those and sort those out and put everything where it needs to be. So let's just talk about why you really want right. to get the session today. Uh, wow, well, it all went so fast. Actually, I just don't know. I am pretty stuck where I am right now. I'm a teacher. I love working with children, but it's not, I think it's not all I can do. Mm -hmm. Or I feel there is something inside of me that is blocked. Mm. And all my life, it, I just felt like being invisible like only being an observer, not really being part of this planet. Mm. Um, yeah, so I struggle with money. Whenever I receive money, it's been taken away or I lose it or love is kind of non-existing. Mm -hmm. It just feels like I'm invisible. I'm not here. I think yeah. that's my biggest problem. Yeah. 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 Okay. No, I understand that completely. Yeah. Um, well, the first thing I do want to say is that um, I'm picking up on that you have a soul contract here, but that you're negating. So spirit is saying you're negating the contract. Okay. okay? Um, which mm -hmm. is why you're feeling <laughs> that you want to be invisible because really where you come from, you were invisible. You were not a tangible, you know, element is yeah. what I'm you, you were not a, t a tangible element um and so I'm almost feeling as if um you were like some sort of like gas so some sort of like asteroid or asterisk gas or something like that I'm feeling that you had some very important work to do in another like star system but it did not involve mm -hmm. interacting in this sort of capacity this you took this for this challenge but you're trying to um you're trying to be like the gases in, in the atmosphere, but you're called to now form and become solid intelligence. Uh, yeah. So you're saying solid yeah. intelligence, I, I guess, because you are a teacher, right? So that does make a lot of sense, yeah. Um, yeah. which which is beautiful. Um, so I see you have a very grounding energy. And actually, you know, it's funny because the other day I, yeah. I had a client and they were they were not grounded at all, but you're too grounded. You're too grounded um, because it's like a fear of, of like a failure to launch is like what your yeah. spirit, your spirit council is saying failure to launch. Um, so you, you are to take more risk, you know, and that's probably mm -hmm. why you picked that career as a teacher. Um, you're being called to express, I'm hearing express the atom inside of you. That's that creation mm -hmm. energy what you're being called to do um it's a foundational energy so i am picking up i'm sorry you say kiki i'll give you your moment but spirit is just really coming through very quickly and clearly um that you are a foundational soul your soul is a residence i'm hearing that it is a, um it's a residence that uh helps to gauge you know certain uh things in this time space continuum so your soul is very important but you, you aren't you're negating the contract at the moment um yeah. you're too a little too grounded okay you, this is your soul your soul wanted to become physical your soul really uh yearned to interact because it spent so much time um being like a solar being um so you just okay. want to root yourself more in community yeah 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 <laughs> that's the first message okay and do you do, do you want to say anything at this moment Kiahe? um um 
what is what is that on your neck is that a crystal yeah that's a sunstone and amazonite beautiful why did you yeah pick those stones oh i just love the colors and the uh, sunstone yeah <laughs> I chose this stone for you today. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> so it has a lot to do with um, clear communication. And um, Ho'oponopono was really coming through today. And also this color, this very Mm. deep, Oh yeah, I love blue, this one. Blue yeah. Color. yeah, yeah, that's so. communication. Yeah, in some way, I also feel I somehow <laughs> lost my voice. These yeah. are also for you. <laughs> So I guess um, hold your color <laughs> back up, Piahe. So we we channel things before oh, the session. Yes. We, will, we will have <laughs> objects, you know. Um, so these are for you. So what, this is what spirit is saying. Put mm -hmm. the flowers in the vase. Put the flower. You have it. Oh. You're not connecting it. Put the flowers in the vase. And um, so here's the thing. You're spending a lot of time in your crowning energy, your crown chakra, and in your third eye, because you are very intelligent. You are an intelligent foundational soul. Um, so you are very expansive, you know, um, which were why you were attracted to those crystals. Um, but mm -hmm. but spirit wants you to have not too much grounding, but almost like you have to take this out of the soil. And then just put it in the vase, put it on your desk. Okay. So it's like you're, 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 you're bridging, you're making like a medium for yourself. Like you are, mm -hmm. um, you know, kind of becoming your own bridge, your own medium, because you have so much cellular data and knowledge um, that your soul just really just has a lot. It really does. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this that's is what I think. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Go, go ahead, Karen. Yeah. I, I always feel that I have quite a lot of power and wisdom but i can't bring it into the world yeah it, um because this world is uh very different from the worlds that you come from and yeah we have to be planted and physical here but not too much where we're too stringent so put the flowers in the vase what is what is this the sweetness of life right enjoy the roses enjoy the flowers yeah. enjoy yeah. you know picking this one here but you have to now do something with that to for for this is how this mm -hmm. third dimension your soul wants to understand how this third dimensional planet goes so it's um it's about a yeah. series of mm -hmm. actions right so you pick the flowers but you put them in the vase and you put them in a place where um when you see them it will bring a certain memory to you and that memory is the communication with the other souls here because we're all part of a big collective soul and Akashic soul. And mm -hmm. um, these are beautiful things, the way we share memories, just as a beautiful scent. So also to having some beautiful perfumes or um, you know essential oils that you really love and resonate with. Um, this is all how you kind of can ground yourself without being too rigid in, in you know, blocking yourself off. Um, you can ground yourself in other ways, just like you have those crystals, right? But you you are taking yeah. them with you, right? You're not like literally planted with them. So so it's you're, you're you're being called to kind of approach yourself a little bit. You're too planted where you're not able to move and receive. Like we need your love here. We need your yeah. light. We need we need that. Yeah. We need you to share that with us with humanity. Hmm. Yeah. So. Um, Let's go ahead and start a little bit of light language and see what we can um, uncode here about your your beautiful yes. um, your beautiful soul, and um, yeah, you you are a I'm here in rocket fire, just like you are star seed. You're absolute star seed, absolute. There's a lot of fire energy. I feel, and it's really weird because you're very peaceful, like like maybe air or water, <laughs> but maybe more air, but you um there's some sort of fire uh energy that you've come from um so let's go ahead and, and just tap deeper into the a little bit more about your soul okay and your soul's journey is what i'm feeling like we need to do today mm -hmm. so what would i like to do i'm going to put you actually in a very uh very comfortable meditative state so you just have to follow after me it's going to be a series of a few deep breaths and then maybe some eye you know staring so we're going to do that and this is going to allow your energy all of our energy to kind of be calm at the same uh, level so we can get a really good right. connection today yeah. so what i have to do is just go ahead and take a very big deep breath in through the stomach and expand that breath. You want to bring it all the way up. Hover it over the crown of your head. 
Just hold it there for a moment, become an observer of it, which you're great at. And once you become an observer of it and maybe the color of it, start to release that down, that forehead in five, four, three, two, one, dropping down all negativity, relax, another deep breath in to that stomach, filling up those lungs with air, holding that energy over the crown, washing it down slowly and gently, washing it, feeling the energy move through the scalp, massaging the scalp over the eyes, down, dropping that jaw down deeper, dropping those shoulders in five, four, three, two, one, relax. One more deep breath in, feeling very calm, filling up that sternum and bringing that energy up and our awareness up. And we're moving that energy down our physical body, side to side, moving the energy down, feeling every so relaxed as this energy moves down, wash it over our shoulders, relax. Every vertebrae of our spine now at five, four, three, Two, one, deeper and deeper, relax, deeper, deeper, relax. And then just go ahead and do me a favor, will you? Go ahead and just open your eyes for me really quickly. And I would like you to pick a spot right above eye level. And I just want you to stare at it. And if you could do me a favor and kind of just, um, yeah, pick that perfect spot. And this spot, believe it or not, is actually going to possess the perfect amount of key codes that you need um, to get unlocked today for your journey. So as we continue to stare and continue to breathe, when I say one, you're going to open your eyes. And when I say two, you're going to close your eyes. You're going to go twice as deep here at Two, eyes closed, relax, deeper, breathe out, relax. Two, eyes closed, deeper, twice as deep. And one, go ahead and stare, open eyes, open eyes, open at one, eyes open at one and two. Dropping down deeper, relax, deeper at five, four, three, two, one. Eyes open, take a deep breath in, eyes open, go ahead and continue to stare at that spot on the wall. And to dropping down deeper, 10,000 times deeper into this all knowing relaxed state, connecting with mind, spirit, and soul, dropping down deeper. One and two, deeper still. One, two, dropping down even deeper, 10,000 times deeper. And one and two, five, four, three, two, Eyes closed, relax, go ahead and relax. Mikiki nakiriki. Mireki ki. Mikiriki nikiriki. Lalaiki, mikiki, makiriki. Mireki nikiki. Lalaiki nirishkiniki. Mareriki, nikiki, mareriki niki. Nikiriki, makiriki niki. Tireki, mireki. Mureki, nakiki, mureki, mirereki, naki, mureki, naki, neki, mureki, nishkereki, naki, naki, shushkereki, mareki, naki, neki, nireki, nireki, neki, nishkereki, neki, maleki, nireki, neki, maleki, nadana, shkereki, muke, niki, nareki, neki, nalashkereki, mureki, naki, nireki, muke, niki, neki, Nalareke, nashkereke, nikeke, mereke, nike, nike, nereke, nike, 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 Are you married at all? No. Okay. Have you ever been married? No. Okay. When I, I could not, this was an agitation, my ring on. So it fell off of me. I had to take it off. This is an agitation. I'm not seeing this is in your soul contract. It's either not in your soul contract. We'll dig a little deeper or you are, you're not allowing it to be. Um. So this is a huge agitation Um. in, in your life. Okay. Um, the other thing is that um, I was picking up on your um, your Akashic soul signature. And so, yes, I am confirming that you were some sort of astro astral gas that um, you are. Uh, that's what you spent your a lot of incarnations doing. So it's very I was doing a light language, very systematic around and around okay. in a loop in a loop this way, back around, back around, back around this way. This this was what you were used to doing. You are used to 
um, like numbers. You're used to like a code and automation. You have an automation template. And so um, with this automation template, is it, it doesn't allow the freedom that, that you need to actually take part in in this third dimensional, you know, life that we are living. So you were just living a lot on automation, which is why you chose to come here to be physical. You want to smell the flowers. Mm -hmm. You know, you're, you're really here to, and you know, you're not here to do, you know, everybody think they're here to do something so grand, grandiose, but you really are here to smell the flowers. That's really why you're here. Because you spent so long smelling gases, if some sort of astro gas is is what you're doing, but you're doing very impor important work on those planets. And I'm seeing that you've moved through multiple dimensions and multiple galaxies. Um, and I'm hearing that there's some inner galaxies in the Earth's core um, that your soul, <laughs> I'm almost getting the sense that you're still doing that work. You need to stop it. You, <laughs> it's like you're still, <laughs> even your soul is still in another place doing the automation work. And it's funny because um, I do know that humanity is moving to inner Earth beings in the future. And it's yeah. funny because- I'm going to actually be an energy source there. So you are actually preparing for, for us mm -hmm. civilizations. You're still doing the automation. You're clearing out gases in, in the atmosphere. And that's what you've been doing for so long, but you are here okay. to smell the flowers. So you are here, honey, <laughs> I think, I think you might need a ring. And I know. Look, well, look at, look at these flowers. I brought some pink flowers and so here too. So look I at think this. you need this is yeah. kind of what we're. <laughs> I think you need yeah. a ring and some flowers, honey. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I do. I, I, I definitely there. Yeah. There's, it's kind of like she, we need to pull her through the atmosphere. She's yeah. kind of on the outskirts of the atmosphere. She's kind of locked out for some weird reason. Maybe, um, I don't know. I don't, mm. you're definitely outside the atmosphere. So I do want to bring you in. That's I do wanna... exactly <laughs> what I feel, being locked out, not being part of something and mm -hmm. just floating around. This is exactly what yeah. I see right now. So I'm going <laughs> to go in and yeah, I'm going to work on this. I'm going to, and it's so interesting. I'm going to reverse engineer this portal for her. So yeah, awesome. okay. that'll be exciting. That'll be okay, exciting. cool. So I will go ahead and we're going to, I'm going to hold the light language for that. And while you go ahead and, and do this work and then we'll pick up some more codes and come back and talk to you in just a moment here, go ahead. Another deep breath in for me. Go ahead. I want you just to relax. Mm -hmm over that energy now dropping it down release it just relax those eyes at five four three two one relax Mother, <laughs> 
Mire, mire che ne dire, mu che ne dire, 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 That was the uh, light language to almost like assist in this crowning you out of this portal that she's working on. It's almost like um, pushing through the atmosphere. There was a veil, some sort of veil, some sort of block. Um, yeah. And uh, are you still doing your work? Yes. Okay. Okay. Uh, I am definitely installing okay. There's some new templates now that you're you're receiving in your heart chakra to around your heart chakra. Your entire energy field, your entire energy body is now sinking to the same template as the seal that's around this atmosphere that you had a hard time penetrating to we're sinking your energy field to the same so now it'll be like a lock and a key a lock and a key you can slip right on through you are actually in the process of slipping through to hear would you like yes. to offer one more light language session yes. and i'll pull her all the way through okay okay Mikidiki, <laughs> Maleriki, Nikirish, Kinidiki, Mikeleriki, Kaleriki, Murek, Nadiki, Murereki, Nadiki, Murereki, Nadiki, Maregiki, Mukiki, Niriki, Niki, Mikiriki, Makiriki, Niki, Marereki, Niki, Mareski, Nidish Kiriki, Maleriki, Marereki, Murereki, Nereki, 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 Nishkiriki, Marike, 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 Mukiriki. Marike, Mukireki, Marike, Mukireki, Marike, 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 Mukireki, 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 Mukireki. Thank you, thank you, thank you. She is, she is inside now. She is surrounded by this beautiful pink, this vibrant pink raspberry light. Her earth field is now pink. So you are on the inside of, you are now going to need to ground this energy, but you're definitely in. We made it through. We, we yes. brought her through. This is amazing. Awesome. Wow. Very that beautiful. was not easy. <laughs> <laughs> there was wow. a block. It was such a blockage. And then um, it was the atmosphere. There's a very tough, you know, when we're penetrating and we're trying to get into new worlds and atmospheres, um, there is like a, a veil there. It was very, very thick. And then also too, um, there was something in your right brain. So I'm not sure what that means. Um, I don't know if you want to pick up on something. There's something in your right brain that needed to be recalibrated for this experience here. Um, so source went ahead and, and okay. did that here. Um, it was it was a lot of work here. It was not wired completely or open. I guess it's not, it was not open to receive the codes you need to ground yourself here. Okay, so that's um, what we did so far. Yes. Wow. Yeah, so, I'm definitely feeling some heat now here around her heart chakra too. So, yeah. Um, yeah. it was definitely connected there. So that's yeah. good. Yeah, I, I feel it too. It's pretty warm here and I felt the tingling right here. So perfect. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And and it's but, uh, it's very but, beautiful because you are a higher dimensional soul. Um, so um a mm -hmm. lot of your gifts have been like collegiate things because you spend a lot of time in your upper chakras, you know what I mean? Because you're really trying to escape this failure to launch. You you're out your you're balanced. Yeah. You're out the door. You are ready to get back to that atmosphere. <laughs> um, but but you're you're being yeah. called to relax, you know, relax into it. And um, your soul really wants to experience um friendships, relationships. It wants to experience yeah. it. Um, and what this is going to do too, it's gonna bring a softness um to your mind. 
So also when I was going like this, it was almost like a recalibration. I was hearing the source say a recalibration between mind and spirit, you know, you're really have just been living in the spirit, which is the crown chakra, you know, which is why we, yeah. you know, we're wearing purple, you know, today we have all this because this is your energy, <laughs> right? That's your energy. But, um, you know, a lot of uh, relationships help us really ground in the space here and, and you're getting used to a new atmosphere and you need to experience that. And, um, but you are blocking it, my dear, because this ring, I could not even do the light language. It just came off. You are blocking it. So we're going to, um, hopefully with those codes that Yahe just gave you in the heart space. Hopefully this so starts to open I do this by myself. I do this by myself. It's not one outside. I do this by myself as a soul or yeah. You do this by yourself, yeah. but, you know, we're, you know, we're here to okay. support you, um, but we're going to give you, yeah. like, we're going to give you some aftercare instructions. So you're going to know exactly what to do um, to accomplish mm -hmm. this. Um, but what I'm seeing is so go ahead and tell me a little bit more about your relational uh, ship life, your romantic life. Have you ever had a, a significant other? Non-existing. It's, it's just, if I meet someone after some days, they're just gone or yeah. They just disappear. Why do you think that is? Me not wanting or not being able, being afraid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is, mm -hmm. I'm picking up on the deep dive. This is the color of the deep dive. This represents you, you going into the depths of your own soul. And that, that is the relationship. This is the, this is the first marriage right mm -hmm. this is the first marriage realm mm -hmm. where you're going to marry you're going to you're going to integrate your feminine and your masculine energetic yeah. relationship and you're going to go diving deep into that realm so i know it's so uncomfortable for you i'm feeling just very like uncomfortability there so what we we can add some some yeah. energy medicine for you there too yeah. and some you know, some discussions on our aftercare where we're going to go into now that integration and that right. relationship. So that way you will manifest it in our physical here. So right. that be exciting. And um, Source just wants to let you know that you are safe here. You're safe here. Um, mm -hmm. this will be a practice for you, um, a very good grounding mm -hmm. practice, understanding you are safe. Um, you are loved and I'm hearing betrothed. I don't know what betrothed means, um, but that's who you, who you mm -hmm. are. And this is how precious you are. And, um, they really want you to get the most. I'm almost getting in a way. There's like people, not people, but souls, but energy watching you from, from the galaxy that you came from. And it's almost as if you're the first of their mm -hmm. kind to come down here. And they're rooting okay. for you. They're really rooting for you. But they're oh. just watching and they're like, this is it. <laughs> so I, I looked up I looked up the definition of betrothed. Betrothed. Uh -huh. The person to whom one is engaged. Yeah. Okay. I mean, you 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 need to find a love. Once you once you marry, you, you your marriage always starts with yourself. And this is very beautiful for you because you're gonna learn from us earthlings mistakes we didn't know that marriage happens inside of yourself first we didn't know that it took us many times of falling in love and yeah. you know unraveling and all of that so you are going to have such a beautiful peaceful special it's going to be precious going to be something that is uh, very unique right your partner will be unique to you right and this is something you're going to be able to call it because you're going to start to go down this road of healing of bringing yourself more grounded so you can and uh, if you like crystals you can um purchase some grounding crystals as well and um okay. go into nature more and things like that um but this will start to happen to you once you um you know with the work that we've done and also once you start to do you know your your spiritual practices um but you need to learn that yes, marriage is first. So, so because you have, this is beautiful for your soul because you have no sort of hangups on relationships and have all this trauma and baggage. Once you truly love yourself and, and I know I feel as if you do, but embrace it here. You can't embrace it as you were. You have to embrace it as you are. You have to look around and see new things or rather see old things in a new way. Right. 
And mm -hmm. once you do that and truly merge the, and I feel as if you're very balanced with this masculine feminine energy, I do want to bring mm -hmm. that feminine energy up a bit, just a bit more, because you're going to need just a bit extra when you want to attract, right? Um, you're going into a mating mm. season. Um, it's a, a mating, <laughs> a mating season, right? Um, so we want to bring that feminine energy up just a bit, and we can address that too in the aftercare instructions. Um, but it's very beautiful because you're going to be able to really merge with yourself because your masculine and feminine are very balanced. You are very balanced. This is okay. rare. No, no, no. I want you, I'm going to gloat on you. You're the model type. <laughs> you are the, you're the model soul type, right? Kiki? She's. I'm getting animalistic. I'm getting primal sounds. I'm getting part of your, um, your healing, um, your medicine, your prescription, <laughs> your, you know, a healing protocol would be to start to make animal sounds that are natural to you, you know, um, whatever animal okay. you're drawn to and their sounds. I feel like that's really going to um, help, help. Uh, there is already a, a masculine energy that I'm already picking up on like instantly that boom, it was like right here. I mean, was so like, as soon was like, as, finally. as He's like, oh, you come up with me? You through. It was like, <laughs> he does exist. That's he exists. And he's so close. He's so close to you. And I feel like I'm hearing animal calls. Like That's why I chose calls. the animal print today. <laughs> oh, wow. wow. Very beautiful. So I'm kind of hearing... I'm kind of hearing within a year, within like a year and nine months, you will, you know, meet this person, be in a relationship and possibly even engaged or married within a year and nine months. Um, this is a, this is beautiful because, you know, love, heartbreak, this is the fastest way for your soul to learn how to exist here. It's going to show you what you're made out of. You have other beings, other souls watching you from where you come from. And they want a show. They're like, we need a show. <laughs> this is boring, you know? <laughs> we want, we, they're rooting for you. I'm, I'm, I'm making jokes of it, but they're rooting for you because in a way they're living vicariously through you. They want to love too. You know, you belong to a huge galactic family. It's almost like you are like very revered and they've sent you off here to gather information, you know? And you are, you know, you're really or you want to go back home, but you haven't done the test yet. So the more you ground into this third dimensional, you know, planet, what you came here to do, um, and you came here to love, you came here to coexist now, understand in partnerships, but first union with yourself first, which I can see is you're, you're very, very close okay. to there, you know, um, but really you came here to make some mistakes, to ruffle some feathers, you know? That's what you came here to do, to just literally experience. Yeah. yeah. Oh, no, I'm, I'm grounding her in that energy right now. I'm okay. grounding. Yes. Grounding Perfect. Her. Let's go I'm ahead and do another to... layer, another layer of grounding mm -hmm. and bring it in. We're going to bring in some feminine energy. And so let's take another deep breath in. Just bring that energy all the way up. Mm -hmm. Hovering it over a crowd. This time we're going to move it even slower down. Five, deeper, four, deeper, three, deeper, two, one, deeper, still relax, relax. And just think about this beautiful pink aura and energy as we're bringing more femininity into you now, more soft fabrics, more silks, more satins, more love, more flowers, more roses, more beauty, more self-expression, lots and lots of self-expression. This is what you need to attract. It's that creative, fertile energy. Your energy, the creative energy is fertility, right? And it doesn't matter what age we're at. So we are giving you this double portion right now. And we just want to fill you up with this, this love. It's this sensual love that is the agape love where you can fall in love with all things you know even nature and people and and trees and everything here but just ground yourself in everything in this third dimensional dimensional planet for a moment yeah and just be in that soft pink energy for me right now mm -hmm. 
Mure ki ne ki ne esh ki ne ne ki. Ne ki re re ki. Mare re ki ne ki ne. Mure re ki mure ki. Mure ki na re ki ne ki. Muke re ki. Mare re ki. Me ki re re ki. Mare re ki ne ki re re ki. Mure ki ne ki re re ki. Ne ki re re ki. Mare ki ne ki. Mure re ki. Mar mar re ki. Muke ki muke ki. Na ki muke. Mare re ki muke na na re. Mare re ki. Mare re ki. Mare re ki. Muke re re ki. Ne ko ra re ki. Mare re ki ne ki ne ki. Mure re ki. Mare re ki. Muke re ki. Ma ki re ne ki ne. Mure re ki ne ki. Mure re ki. Mere ki ne re ki. Mare re ki. Mane ki. Mure ki. Mure ki muke na re ki muke. Mae ki ne re ki mure ki. Mare re ki. Mure re ki ne ki ne re ki ne re ki ne ki mure ki. Muke ki muke re re ki. Mere re ki mare ki. Ne ki re re ki. Ma ki re re ki muke ne re ki. Mure ki na ki re ki. Oh, so beautiful. Whoa, so beautiful. whoa, the Kundalini energy is arisen, erosion. <laughs> it's up, it's everywhere, it's it, it's permeating. The Kundalini was just awakened in you. So yeah. you may yeah. want to move your body tonight. Yeah. You know, put on some some music. Uh, music. Um, some music that is Central gonna move, music. you know. That move your pelvis mm -hmm. in a yeah. circular motion. Mm -hmm. um, even yeah. on the ground, on your floors, I see you. I see you just like evoking your kundalini energy and letting it spiral up. Okay. Yes. And just play around with that. Play around with your cool. play with that energy in your body and and yeah. pay attention to how it's making you feel in your skin. Yeah. Also, too, while you're mm -hmm. doing that, I really want you to put something very soft, very almost like very sensual on. Um, this is the the that union within self. You know, it's almost like this, this is your wedding night. It's what spirit is saying. This is your wedding night. <laughs> this is your wedding night. You are going to be in the energy. And I'm not telling you what to do, what else to do, girl. But you, <laughs> I'll leave that up to you. <laughs> this is your wedding night. And um, you are really... Mm -hmm. um, coming into union with yourself first and then the rest will follow so what I was seeing is you were receiving mm. a you were receiving a heart and it was a pink heart and it literally was heart shaped so this is that attraction there you go look at those hearts <laughs> this is spirit spirit wants to give you what so sweet. Uh, yes <laughs> spirit is saying and all the other people that are watching you, they are really watching you. They're like, we want to love. We want to love. We want to show, right? So <laughs> they are like really excited for you. And you have this pink heart now. And it's literally going to attract people to you. You're going to be a magnet. Seriously. You are going to be attracting so many people, not just men. Like people are going to be attracted to you. Something they're going to be like, something's different about you. You know, this is a daily practice and <laughs> nighttime practice. I want you to like really soak in a bath. You really filling yourself with up mm -hmm. with this new frequency, soaking in a bath with bubble bath, putting some really nice, good essential oils in there, um, nurturing yourself really sometimes maybe go to a spa or a salon or just something very simple for yourself. But a night practice, a very feminine, mm. get some very light pink um, satin. Um, either lingerie or, you know, pajamas or something mm -hmm. like that. And, and just move your body and you're just, you're expressing what you're doing is you, it's a mating call. You're going to be. <laughs> and I feel like oils, rub oils, oils mm -hmm. on your skin. Yeah. You, can oh, yeah. Like, you know, some, some drops of some rose oil mixed with any kind of nut or seed oil that you love on your skin and warm it up. And like rub yeah. warm oil, mm -hmm. that essence in it and just yeah. and make a spiritual practice. That's kind of mm -hmm. going to be like a spiritual practice every night, right? You're going to make right. your spiritual bath. You're going to apply your oils. You're going to have your music and you're going to go right into sound healing Kundalini. Yeah. Okay? You know what too? Also, Thank I'm downloading, you. I'm downloading for you like hot candle wax touching your skin. I don't know why. Um, 
just hot candle it's some sort of fire energy too that you need but it's still also very like okay the drips like I don't know it's like something that that you need so maybe some hot candle wax don't burn yourself but you know what I mean it's just preparing mm -hmm. you <laughs> for it's kind of preparing okay. you for the um Mm. It's on the, your sacral uh, energy on your sacral chakra the sacral area on your abdomen if you can drip the hot wax there I was feeling mm -hmm. lo loads of energy there so it was like it was pulsating so I think the hot wax will help draw it up and out drip up. okay mm -hmm. yeah and goodness I was gonna say something it's like it, it's like mm -hmm. you're getting primed you're getting primed for this uh spontaneity of a relationship you know what I mean? That's what that hot candle wax is like. It's priming you for the partner that's coming in. It will be like very spicy, you know? Whoa, I don't know what that was, but I think that was him that popped up. There it is. Salivation. Okay. Yeah. And so I'm, I'm salivating too. Yeah. So it's almost like I'm, I'm feeling like he's, he, he might actually work with books or something with wood, wood or something. Um, I'm kind okay. of seeing something like that or something natural or nature or something, something of that. Um, he has a very, a uh, very niched, um, jo job or career or business that he's in. It's kind of like more solo work. So you guys will blend a lot in that way. Cause you're kind of like a solo being, but you guys will be playful together. So that hot candle wax is the spontaneity of what you guys will ah. be, the energy of you guys together. So it's still the mating call, right? That's what you're doing. You are literally doing a mating call. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I this is getting spicy. Oh my god! I didn't know it was gonna be. I know. I'm getting hot. I'm like hot. Yeah, I'm, I'm so warm. I'm salivating. <laughs> I'm just girl. This is good. This, I'm you so are a warm. Firecracker. I'm always freezing, but I'm so warm now. <laughs> I am so warm too. Like I'm so oh. warm. This is crazy. So it just goes to show you how energy works. Everything is already in your energy field. He's already in your energy field. You've just been blocking him out because I think you haven't been able to really permeate this veil and ground yourself here. But then all these things we're saying will mm -hmm. allow you to do mm -hmm. that. He's already been here. He's been in your energy. And so when you, when you mate with yourself, when you call him in by doing these practices, he's going to come running right to you. And then just a really, you need a, you need a signature scent. This is something that's just for you, a signature scent. Okay. Yeah, you need yeah. something that really makes you feel special, uh, loved, protected, nurtured, beautiful, you know, and all of the rest of the adjectives, right? Um, so spirit wants you, you to have that, to gift yourself with that you know it's weird because i think we do a lot of sessions and spirit is spirit gives like assignments of to women of with how they should take care of themselves spirit <laughs> wants you to have a, a signature fragrance that's just you and so i think that's gonna okay him in. yeah when he smells it it's going to be familiar to him and he's going to be like that's the one that's that scent <laughs> yep <laughs> okay that's cool awesome so do you want to move this in a different direction or um do you want me to just see what i pull Was the question to me? Yes, yes. Do you want me to move this? Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Just, just. Uh, I just. Uh, yeah. Whatever okay. I get is perfect. <laughs> okay. All right. So, uh, Kiahe, I, I feel as if um, you're gonna be, you're gonna be pulling the messages this time. So I'm just kind of gonna be just. I'm gonna just. I'm just holding my hands like this. I'm just gonna allow you to, to nurture that which I think is already arising within you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. absolutely yeah. I'm definitely I can smell rose rose oil roses I can smell mm -hmm. white white um lilacs has something like this I'm just, it's a jasmine or lily oil yeah I, I was hearing lily or um, lilacs yeah okay yeah that's gonna be key scent very literally like that that yeah. i'm tasting something too like um mm. strawberries mm. strawberries definitely um add add loads of strawberries <laughs> what is this energy wow this is beautiful. This is divine feminine energy templates that you're getting. It is. 
This mm -hmm. is very special. This is a, a gift. Mm -hmm. It's a gift. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm feeling like um, all of these sense of what Kiahe is saying. And it's it's weird because I'm even moving my hands and like smell the roses, smell it. You know, it's like a fragrance, right? Mm -hmm. You're kind of um, acclimating to the pheromones that you need to mm -hmm. draw in this mm -hmm. partner. So all of that. And even eating the strawberries is actually going to give you a special scent because we all have scents. So you okay. need to really have yeah. those those berries um to give you your special mm -hmm. pheromones and it's going to help you draw this it's quite this divine it's, partner it's, absolutely it's adding to her pheromone quality there yes. i can smell her skin it smells like strawberries mm -hmm. coming through in yeah. the pheromone quality in the chemical makeup that you're going to start producing now and i'm 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 drinking i'm drinking sparkling water with with a uh, strawberry juice um, added to it as well so okay. this is um this is all part of you know the 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 taste the senses the sensuality you know you're permeating yeah. yourself with this new fragrance and you know we're chemical making uh beings and this is this is a this is medicine this is going to be the medicinal quality of your I'm hearing your purpose mm. yeah. Mm. I'm there's an energy rising within me right now and this is really coming from source it's coming from our mother's source um, that we are uh, in sisterhood with as well she wants you to know that when you are in this love making and love making is not just like being mm -hmm. physical with someone all of these things that we're saying this is an energetic love making for you I, my body feels so light. I feel like I'm floating. Mm -hmm. You know, the butterflies <laughs> you get in your stomach when you are in love. She's saying that this is going to bring pitter patter to you. Pitter patter of the heart, pitter patter of the gut, you know, because that's your mind, your heart and your, your gut is also your mind. And, you know, source is really calling you to, to bridge the gap and bring to the heart, bring your awareness down from the crown, from the head, from the third eye and bring it down to the heart and gut, because these are the minds that source wants you to use to acclimate and get grounded into this third dimensional frequency. Um, so you're going to be loving and living now from the gut. So what this means is you're going to be following passions, right? Not so much headstrong and just doing everything, mm -hmm. you know, very calculated. You need to get into the gut and to the heart. This is not only going to call this in, but it's going to allow you to ground and get the most out of this experience. And That's you're cool. here to love, right? And so I want you to take chances, do something spontaneous, something that you would never do. It could be something so simple, mm -hmm. you know? It can be a spontaneous mm -hmm. trip. It can be a spontaneous drive to just another county, you know, just something off the beaten path. This is your training yourself to be whimsical. You need to become whimsical in this experience because really we are the creators. This is a very cool place called Earth. We are literally the creators of our existence here. But you have to train mm -hmm. yourself to know that we need to live more in the heart and in the gut. These are also your mind. So don't feel that you will be without your mind because your heart and your gut is your mind. Okay. That's from Mother Source. Okay? So cool. Yeah. Love it. I love that. I feel like she's gonna have like a full body orgasm, <laughs> you know, through this whole process. <laughs> I think, honey, if you do all those things, I think you're gonna be in good shape. You might not need this. You might not need the man after that. <laughs> oh, it's oh beautiful. Goodness. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy, I'm so happy <laughs> for you. This is yeah. so good. Thank you. This is so yeah. Good. Um, this is such a treat for us like I didn't know this it would so be cool. like this and you know mm -hmm. just even even an, another thing source is addressing even things in your house you might need time to redecorate um add some lighter and you know of course we're sort of moving into uh like the like the spring so you may want to like take down things that are like dark at this moment and just kind of Freshen up yeah. with white pillow, white white pillows, you know, like white flowers. I'm hearing lilacs or lilies, right? What she was channeling, and um, you know, make everything light around you because we want the energy right to circulate. We don't need the energy getting stuck in you exactly. know up here in the headspace. Yeah. So we'd like for you to do that, um, and even if it's just one space at a time, 
um, the, the bedroom or the place you spend the most time in, but really just freshen up, freshen it up with some, some white. Um, I'm feeling the essence of white and like baby pink. White, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. and some twinkling lights or candles. I feel too. It's gonna, mm -hmm. it's gonna help. Um, you know, you're 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 a star. You came from you know yeah. you're a star seed. You know, you this are your star seed. You, we pulled it all the way through, so she's definitely a star seed. You are not, you are a ninth dimensional galactic vein. It might even be like an intergalactic vein. Um, but you are a star seed of that ninth dimensional. I'm hearing mm -hmm. power or order. Um, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. So you're, you're very high vibrational, very, very high vibrational. Um, but when it's not grounded, it just comes off as like almost yeah. a little arrogant or, or, you know, something like that, you know, just needs to ground a little bit more. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what yeah, happens. That was the feel, this was the feeling I always had that people just don't get me and I don't get them. There was yeah. a disconnection in between. Yeah. <laughs> right, right. Right. All of these things will help you, will help you really ground into mm -hmm. that and change your your aroma because yeah. you know i spoke about mm -hmm. you know humanity and, and women the feminine getting a new sweet aroma and so let's do that let's let's um implant a new aroma just how we were picking up on the pheromones but let's go ahead and um mm -hmm. give her like an extra dose of this new sweet aroma and what it is it is mm -hmm. a divine template from source that is literally you're just going to be in a soft air where you don't really have to move with your masculine thoughts brawn and brain you know you can move with petals you know you can move more whimsical be in more, that more creative more fairy like energy right um this also too will help you ground into the third dimensional space and then also too it's going to help you know attract this this man to you as well so let's go ahead and mm -hmm. give you this new sweet aroma Mudereke, Mirereke, Nareke <laughs> this aroma is going to be like very everlasting when someone smells and even when you get a sniff of it yourself it's like it lingers you're you are the thought that lingers uh, spirit wants you to ground more in the inner child become more whimsical so we are working really more on the divine feminine aspect of ourselves and the child um inner child aspects of ourselves so do more playful things you know and it can be something small you go outside and you play or you just be whimsical go to the the park and take a swing right and yeah. just ground yourself in, in that and this aroma is going to be a lingering right that's what's going to have, help you move from up here center more, more down it's really grounded in that inner child too more playful right thank you yeah you're welcome yeah so do you have any notes at this time Kiahe? 
the work is amazing the session is amazing i'm just reverberating everything into the seal inside of the seal now so you're not no longer outside of that seal you're inside now okay so just give mm -hmm. yourself time to adjust and ground and enjoy this process you're going to start feeling immensely delicious yeah. That's what I'm yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I didn't even see it. It's it's in a weird way. It's 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 like you're getting you're receiving like a spiritual makeover, right? You know how when um you see those movies and the the the, the girl comes to a new school and everyone's mm -hmm. dressed differently and she comes from like a small town and she's not this is what mother source is giving to you. It's almost like let me give you a makeover for the third dimensional planet, you know? <laughs> give you this makeover, right? So they want you to really just hone in on um the, the physical aspects of yourself, maybe a different haircut or color, just something that was going to fire, you know, like I'm just seeing maybe, maybe try something red or something with the hint of it, or there's something that needs to be expressed. A creative aspect of the feminine wants to mm -hmm. be expressed through your beauty. Right. Yeah. I'm excited. Send us photos, Ooh, please. Yeah. Please <laughs> <Yes. laughs> send us photos. <laughs> this is, this is just sure. so, it's so beautiful. It, it really is beautiful. Um, How do you feel now? Very, very happy. <laughs> really, so. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's good to hear. Light That's and warm hear. and oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is, this is. so receptive. Yeah, absolutely. She was yeah. ready. She's because she's so higher dimensional. It's very beautiful. <laughs> um, just to channel in a little bit more into these these energies, they keep showing up in your session. They're yeah. like um, they're almost like little fairies, but they're not. They're mm -hmm. little like you know little particles that you know you used to be with for eons, right? They're really happy <laughs> for you. It's like, yeah. you know, when you, it's like when the the I don't know when you send your your child away and to do something, it's like you know, they're going in it at a, alone, you know, it's just, they're, they're really happy for you to have this experience. Um, and they're rooting for you. They're supporting you and, um, they are vicariously living through you. So, uh, mm. and they just want you to be happy. It's really that simple. They want you to play playful, the joys of this life, not a care in the world. There'll be plenty of time to get back to work, but this lifetime, the rest of your lifetime is really about being more feminine about being loved and nurtured in that way, allowing like there's like some sort of chemical essence you're going to get when you start to blend mm -hmm. with this divine man that's coming in. He's going to bring a lot of upgrades to you, to your soul's expression and your own soul's records. And it's going to now start to build a beautiful template for uh, more physical lifetimes, right? Because I do feel as if this is like one of the very few you're really new at this, at this being physicality in such a dense place. Mm. Yeah. So this man that's coming through, um, I'm hearing surrender to the passion, surrender to the lust, and even surrender to a little bit of pain. Because when you mix all of those together, it's providing mm. you like a template that you're building for the next leg of your expansion. Um, because you will mm -hmm. start to be, be take in more physical incarnations. And so you're going to need to be a little bit more agile. You're going to need more codes. You're going to need to learn how to interact with people. Right. So that's what I'm hearing. All right. And I'm, I'm hearing like, you're going to want to pinch yourself. <laughs> you're, I don't know. I just keep pinching myself right now. And I'm like, oh, okay, she's going to, she's going to want to pinch herself. It's going to, yeah. It's going to be that it's going to be different for you. And you do have a big mama energy that came through too uh, when we pulled you through. So you definitely have that essence surrounding you too that you are so familiar with. But as you come now into the unknown, um, you're going to definitely want to pinch yourself. You're going to be like, is this for real? <laughs> it's going to feel <laughs> unbelievable, but definitely believe it. Believe it. Thank you. It's yeah. for you. It is. It's it's very very beautiful, and then just to um, the nutrition. Um, I don't know if you eat a lot of fruit, but I'm just it's just such a berry essence of even what Kiahe was um, berries. I'm seeing you with lots and lots of berries, and this is probably berries, really good. 
Yes. Mm -hmm. This is probably really cool because nuts and berries, right? That's what I'm seeing you. It's mm -hmm. really cool because it's grounding you in that, like, even that mm -hmm. there's an aspect that you didn't get. Like a lot of our souls, we have like had like ancient incarnations here, right? It's like this berry and like almond essence or nut essence is kind of like grounding you to the land here. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, it's beautiful. It really is. So mm -hmm. yeah. this was, um, I really, I'm really not feeling that there's any lack in this session I, I feel that he's so receptive me too I'm you were scanning, very easy. scanning and, <laughs> yeah. and we're scanning we, we scan the different like mental body emotional body physical body mm -hmm. I'm not seeing any blockages you know mm -hmm. I, this is it's rare none see none block. that you're was beautiful. it <laughs> very beautiful I just yeah because a, a lot of times we'll spend a lot of time clearing blockages from people you don't have any of that mm -hmm. so i know you're a new soul um mm -hmm. well, one the advice of a new soul i do need to give you some advice of a new soul and i feel like sources saying this to you um the advice of a new soul is to make mistakes mm -hmm. so is this the first incarnation on earth for me i'm feeling i'm feeling like it is i'm feeling like there's yeah yeah that's why weird. everything feels so weird yeah it's yeah, yeah. it's weird it is the first yeah. is the first um you're the first and your your council um you know they're saying you're the first of our kind here you're the first of our kind um and so all of this work you're doing is not just for you it's for those other souls that carry that template um okay. you're building a foundation you are a foundational soul um and as a foundational soul, we need lots of templates, right? Not just one, not just the one where you're like, you know, headstrong and, you know, collegiate. We need you to play. We need the inner child to pop out. We need the passions in life. We need to see how you react mm -hmm. to that. Put those stamps in the Akashic record. So your, um, your other people that have been in these other incarnations with you, the other souls, they will be able to now tap into your energetic signature here. They're going to be following your lead. So you know, the young soul needs to make mistakes. It's okay. You okay. can let go. You can let go. They're going to always, you're not going to get in any trouble. Your, your guides will always be there to protect you. Mm -hmm. But it's just really grounding more in a youthful kind of um, passion for mischief. You know, it doesn't okay. have to be bad, but just passion for mischief a little bit. Yeah. Yes. I'm so excited for her. I'm so excited for you. <laughs> yeah, I'm so happy. I am so happy. Um, so I think that we were actually giving you all the aftercare instructions um, yeah. while we were going along. So I'm going to send this video to you within um, how I awesome. do it is um, the files are so big. So what I do is I just upload it as a private video. On, on okay. the back end of my page, you are the only person that will have the link. So it'll be completely mm -hmm. private. And then I will get that to you within 72 hours and you can go through it. And then you can write down all Perfect. of these things and start implementing it. But um, Source always does give us, um, do you want to tell her what to do for the rest of the day to really hone in this energy, like any sort of practice or, or bath or anything she should do? Mm -hmm. I'm feeling the, um, the sparkling water, sparkling mineral water with like like a splash of like strawberry juice or Stop some it. type mm -hmm. of yeah or uh here we have guavas i'm not sure where you're living um but some kind of pink juice that you want to kind of or pink raspberry juice. yeah mm -hmm. yeah raspberry or any type of yeah something like this and, and sip i'm just really craving that right now that's what i'm feeling <laughs> her body um you know activate activate your uh your glands yeah i'm okay. hearing your saliva yeah. glands mm -hmm. yeah yeah I'm, I'm actually picking up on that too just some to the activation here you know because you're gonna you're gonna need this there's so much that goes on there you know when you're in a relationship and stuff yeah just activate just knowing like the different parts of you that needs um some extra care um, and just be in this very sensual energy. And even if you want to put that juice in like a wine glass and just, um, yes, you know, yes, definitely. I'm seeing idea. you drink it in a wine glass. <laughs> yes. yes. Yeah. You're just like, yeah. you're swirling it and you're just yeah. like, you know, you're allowing your taste buds <laughs> and your salivation glands to just, just start being, becoming active now. So 
Mm-hmm. Have fun with that. <laughs> yeah, that's it. And, um, mm-hmm. you know, pick up some flowers, you know, pick up some flowers. I, you know, yeah. your white flowers, I, you know, you said lilies and I said lilacs, but mm-hmm. I heard lilies too. So maybe they are lilies or lilacs, um, but you definitely some white flowers. Um, this is very kind of indicative of your wedding night. You know, this is, mm-hmm. this is like that energy, right? And so that's what I'm just, all things white for you surrounding yourself. It's bringing in, you know, the, the purity of that partnership that you're looking for. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So exactly. the signature, the signature scent would be perfect with lilacs or um, is well, that up to me? Or... Yeah, it doesn't, doesn't matter. matter. I, I don't... It doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, um, I think you were saying like some rose or jasmine in the scent. But like yeah. when you go to the perfumery, I'm almost getting the sense that you need to get a perfume made for you. I'm really. Yeah. Oh, all right. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting that sense where and, and it'll be a kind of a cool little outing for you um, just to yeah. go and take in all those smells and scents because like okay, I said, you, are well, new, cool. you are a new soul here. You haven't <laughs> done this before. So it's, we mm-hmm. need you to be a little bit um, mischievous. You know what I mean? You, we need you to start looking through things. This is, this is the explore. You, you're the Dora Explorer. Yeah. You know, this is the, yeah. the, this is the lifetime you're in. You, you need to be very, um, you know, looking for things, searching for things like, you know, little tiny things that to people would be like, why are you looking for that? But this, just enjoy it. This is your first lifetime and you want to experience all of it. So please go and make a signature uh, fragrance for yourself, even if it's um, at a perfumery or even if it's, um, you know, people who mix essential oils together or however you want to okay, do that. Like, yeah. Special for you. And um, just have some really nice white flowers around and get some like white pillows and freshen up your space with that and some really nice um nice candles you know just something that makes you feel really good okay Mm -hmm. it's that wedding night energy you know it's that that's what I'm feeling I remember when I had that um when I went through that phase as well where I created my own wedding night energy I didn't even know it until that that energetic code raptured me Mm -hmm, but mm -hmm. that all those little steps where you're going out and you're gathering the scents and you're gathering the tastes and you're gathering you know all Mm. the different elements and then once you're in it there will be another energy that comes through and raptures you and and it's like you know it's like you you've now caught up to where you want to be right it's almost like you're meeting yourself where you're at now all of you all the aspects of you can now energetically sync to exactly what it is you're wanting to pull in and manifest and you're going to feel it it's going to feel like a rapture so that's kind of what i'm feeling (laughs) yeah you have a a lot of beautiful work to do you know a lot of other people's work are very heavy but yours is very playful very good yeah this is amazing yeah do you you have any other questions for us or any other thing that oh actually no okay no so sounds perfect i'm in now so yeah (laughs) the last thing i think that i would like for us to do uh is Mm -hmm. go ahead and put our energies around her and kind of just do the final aspect of this seal this energy seal with her and um, okay. we're going to be kind of um, powering this um, kind of sisterhood remembrance um, as a remembrance, a template to your soul that you know that you're going to always be loved and supported and nurtured. And, you know, we are also of a higher dimensional frequency. And so you know that you have many homes, your soul will have many homes, but now that you're used to being called to really ground yourself here. So let's go ahead and put our energy around her and just sail in this beautiful energy and just go ahead and relax for us and close your eyes and breathe deep. And I want to hold this with a, in a silence for you, okay?
Beautiful. I have one more message for you. I was able to see a glimpse of you and your partner, just how in love and happy you were. And you were wearing like some purple beads around your neck. So what spirit is saying is they want you to ground yourself either in a purple crystal or some sort of necklace that has a purple essence to it. Because what you're doing is you're going to now be bringing this where you were spending most of your time in your upper chakra. You're going to be bringing this chakra down to your heart. And so it's going to be mm -hmm. the mind that you're going to now think of. You're going to always have that purple necklace or, or okay. um, clearing. I'm hearing clearing um, crystal to your heart space. And that's where we want you to stay here. Your heart, do everything from the heart and, and love and be mischievous from the gut, right? A few nibbles of chocolate will do you good. <laughs> yes. I also heard I also heard give my mama a little kiss for me oh. Oh. you resonate with that at yeah. all? do you have any children or like children that weren't realized or um Spirit uh, you, uh, you just your, your your video just stopped for some moments, so I didn't hear what you said. But you asked if I have children. Yeah, um, either a I spirit. Heard, um, mm -hmm. Go ahead. No, or mm -hmm. spirit spirit babies. We like to call them like babies that didn't come all the way through. Or no, oh, I think her thing glitched. No, I heard. I heard. Uh, Give my mama a, a little kiss from me. Ooh. Wow. Mm. Okay. There might be a child that's going to enter your life. It's either um, one or two wow. things. It's, um, there might be a child going to enter your life. Um, yeah. I don't know if like the, the man that you're going to meet has children or if you guys will somehow produce children together, if that's in the cards for you. But um, Or this is like a spirit baby that is um, just... It, we're picking up on their energy um, mm -hmm. because you've had many incarnations. Um, okay. But but you're loved and supported and there is a child energy that is present with you. So spirit is saying, this is like your plate, right? If you want, if you want that experience, I will give it to you. If you want the motherly experience, just call that forth. And even if you can't call it forth in your physical body, you can wow. you can call you can call it forth yeah. outside of you through um I'm hearing um through the merit marriage and the the man bringing you know a child into it or even through uh, adoption right this could also it's it's I'm not feeling the energy that it's a pet baby that you know it's actual you know human child you know so mm -hmm. but it's your it's mm -hmm. your choice mm -hmm. your choice okay okay yeah. <laughs> Okay. sweet <laughs> very cool so we're just gonna go ahead and uh, send you off to your highest vibrations as we walk together in divine love and we do thank mother source of the 12th dimensional stargate for this beautiful transmission with this beautiful soul today we want you to just be well and love and love and love and grow okay thank you Thank you so much. You're, You're so welcome. beautiful. Yeah. Your soul is so beautiful. <laughs> it was my pleasure. Yes, you have <laughs> Thank a beautiful you. soul. Okay. Take care. And if you need us again, we, we will, will go here. out and. Yeah, sure. Keep us close. I will go out and have some fun tomorrow. Ooh, yes. Okay. Rock us. <laughs> send us pictures. That's such a great homework, really. Wow. Yes. Yes. Send us pictures, okay? Very beautiful, okay? We will talk For to sure. you soon. For sure. You're welcome. Thanks. Okay, bye. 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 See you. Bye.